What is up guys? I'm back with another quick tutorial. This time I'm going to show you how to add a third person camera in Skater XL. So it's basically a photo mode and you have to do the trick out of the camera angle so it's a little bit difficult. But it's still fun for some alternative angles and some B-roll so let's do it. So you need Unity Asset Bundle Extractor. You're going to want to open your level file. So you go to File, Open. Find your Skater Excel data folder. Should be in your programs files if that's where your Steam games are located. If not, you can locate your Skater Excel data folder by going to the game on Steam, Properties, Local Files, Browse Local Files, and that's the folder you have to find. Okay, now back to Unity Asset Bundle Extractor. You're going to go to File, Open. You're going to go back to your Skater Excel folder. Go to the Skater Excel data folder. Find level zero should be just level zero open it scroll down select the last one click ok let this happen and now you're going to find the path id 14619 i'll do that now One four six one nine. The name of that is Game Object Photo Cam. Now, what you're going to want to do is export dump. Save this on your desktop. And then you're going to get a text file on your desktop. Open this text file. Find this bottom section right here. Change this from false to true. Click save. You can exit that. And now you're going to want to import the dump back in. So now make sure you have game object photo cam selected again. Import dump. Select that same file. Select OK. Now it loaded in the edited file, which activated the photo cam. Select OK. Select yes. Now save this level zero file back on your desktop. And now this is your current level edited to have a camera. Now to use the camera, you hit X or square on your controller and X again to activate it. You can also press RB to freeze and unfreeze your skater. Now you're just gonna wanna take this level file, copy it and paste it into your Skater XL data folder. Copy, paste, and select replace the file in the destination.